Coco! He's good. I heard him. <laughs> he returned the caca. That's our code. We don't want to yell out right now because there could be people back here and we don't want to, you know, reveal any secrets because <laughs> I'm sure everybody's dying to get back here. So, caca! Caca! He's all right, folks. He's all right. Hey, it's Small Mouth Crush. Welcome to my YouTube channel and welcome to 2019. We're almost there, but I wanted to do a quick recap of the 2018 season. And so what I did is I actually put together uh, some various videos, tournament fishing, uh, tackle prep, just anything and everything on my channel. Some of the fun times I had in 2018. Hopefully you guys will enjoy that. I'm gonna break it up into two parts. So we have a part one, which is what you're gonna be seeing right now. And in a couple days, I'm gonna upload uh, part two, just because it got a little lengthy. A lot of stuff went on in 2018. Again, I wanna thank you guys for subscribing to my channel. Channel's really grown, it's taken off. It's been an awesome year. I'm looking forward to 2019. Hope you guys have a wonderful New Year's and I hope you guys enjoy the video. Well, my first video of 2018, Epic Eric and I head on out to the Chesapeake Bay doing a little silver buddy fishing. We're about to get so much bigger. Why so small? I don't know, man. I think once we get deeper, we're going to run. But look, there is such a population of fish in here. It's crazy, man. Okay. Easy, 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 easy. Okay, okay, okay. You be easy, I'll be easy. What you doing, man? Well, the first tournament of 2018 was also on the Chesapeake Bay. FLW Touring Pro, Gray Buck and myself, head on out, try to put a few fish in the boat. We caught a few. We caught a few. Whoa! It was fun. It's always fun yeah, hanging you out you with your buddies <laughs> in the local tournament in the middle of the winter. Well, we had a lot of downtime as well during the early winter months. And so I talked a lot about my tackle setup. This was a pretty popular video of how I have all my tackles set up. I go through in-depth detail as far as storage, how to store your hard baits, your plastics, your terminal tackle. It's all there. If you haven't seen this video, I encourage you to check it out. Hopefully you can get some tips to get yourself organized. Let me go through this box with you guys, okay? So, as we open her up, you're gonna see a bunch of plastic bags. I also make a video breaking down every single rod that I own and the reason behind it. This is a pretty good video if you wanna get in depth on the different rods and reels that I use for each different technique that's out there. It's a real simple process. I'll let you kind of take over since, uh, you know, you like to get your hands dirty. All right, guys. So here's what we've got going on. I also made a few videos with my buddy Kevin on basically drop shot weights, tube inserts, and how we make them, and the ones I suggest using. So those are some pretty cool videos. If you want to learn a little bit more about that, I encourage you to check those out. Then, of course, I head down to the Bassmaster Classic. My buddy Matt and I went down there to help Mercury out like we do every year. Definitely looking forward to going back this year. It's going to be an interesting classic, that's for sure. We will have the video cameras going. So all three days of the event, I get to sit up here in the VIP section, all the food, drinks that you want, awesome view we're able to watch the anglers uh, come in on the big screen Bassmaster Live was uh, shot filmed right in front of us and of course it was so cool seeing Jordan Lee win two times second year in a row and we get to sneak out and head to the big party tonight I went to Ike's party last year and so I knew that this one was going to be a blast Yo, yo, hold on. Test, test, test. Can you hear? Can you hear? We should, we should probably, we should probably talk to the guest. Man, right here. Woo! Folks ah! at home. You're, you're part of this. <laughs> 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 yeah. 
yeah, yeah. So All funny. right, ready? Folks at home, folks at home, watch Ike Live. There you go. Now watch, watch Ike Live con queso edition. <laughs> That's with cheese. From Wisconsin? <laughs> Might as well be. It's Wisconsin. This was actually a pretty cool video. This was um, this was the Susquehanna River, right after a major snowstorm. Joe and myself had out, do a little smallmouth fishing. It's still cold, but spring is just around the corner. Let's go! I'm working on it. We're really doing it, man. And we actually caught a few fish that day. Can't beat that. Good old small in the middle coming of winter. In, coming in. Coming in hot. Boom. Coming in hot. Dang. Dude, that's a nice one. Yeah. That's a good river smallmouth. All right, so today I'm fishing with my buddy Jack. Uh, Jack and I fished a couple tournaments. Uh, it's been a while, actually. We fished a tournament last year right out here. We had almost 25 pounds and got beat. We took second place. We got beat by Mr. Centaur, the local stick here. And there he is. What up? What up? Here we go. Where are we going today, Captain? We're going to my favorite spot. Oh. It's three minutes away. Of course. That's what we always do. Finally, we're getting some warm, warm weather, and the fish are starting to cooperate. Let's hope we get some warm weather quick this year as well. What are we doing today? Did have an opportunity to fish for some stripers on the Chesapeake Bay this spring. I'm actually looking forward to hopefully hitting it just right this spring as well. Maybe get some of those uh, nice sized stripers that they get in the springtime. Day one launch, boat 20. We got cold with us. What's up, what's up? We're gonna try to catch a few fish. Uh, we're gonna wing it today, so we're gonna try to fish. Uh, I'm gonna fish new water. All my stuff is pretty much blown out and muddy, what I believe. So I'm going to try to Try something a little different. We're going to stay in the river here. See if we can uh, put something together. Well, finally, the first bigger tournament that I fish was a BFL on the Potomac River. There was a day one and day two was back to back this year. And didn't have a, didn't have a good start here. Uh, didn't do well at all. But um, a good learning experience, and it got me ready for the remainder of the year, I guess you could say. All right, guys, that concludes Derby Day. So, man, we made it. It was a grind. Got to check. So I don't even, I'm embarrassed to say this, but I believe I took 35th place. I of like 200 boats, but uh, I don't know. We have another tournament tomorrow, so we'll see what happens as far as points go. But I'm going to need a 20 plus pound bag to feel good about life. So if you guys are new to my channel, I basically film every tournament that I fish all year long as well as practice. And this is uh, no exception this year. The 2018 BFL season is all out there on my channel. I encourage you to take a look at any of those videos if you want to see some tournament action. Hey, look, there's some birds, bees in the grass. Check that out. Yeah. We already found something. It's starting out to be a lucky day. That's got natural beeswax, Travis, and you being a naturopathic kind of guy. Uh, would you like it? <laughs> <laughs> I don't think I'm gonna Here, pass on go. that. <laughs> oh, I did. You put that on uh -huh. your lip. Oh, on. It's got color on it. <laughs> of course, I have fun with Epic Eric and our shenanigans. 
it's never a dull moment when I'm fishing with Eric. Of the Eric. What's up? Woo! I'm feeling much better after getting over that mud flat. Crazy! Zero foot of water. It's all right. But we're here. Stop! What the heck? It's all coming up. <laughs> the legend of the big bass. Travis has got us on the meat again on Smallmouth Crush. Uh, let me go. A little bit, he's cute. That's the one you've been waiting for. Oh, look at this one, dude. <laughs> nice. Oh. Get that fish in the boat. He's on the trolling motor, too. What happened? I cleared. Clear. 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 Oh, man, look at that. That's a big one, dude. Oh. Wow. How do you do it, Speed? How do you get that hair like that? You just do. <laughs> did, you, um, did you style it for today's episode? Looks that way, doesn't it? I think so. I did. It's not this shoe, correct? No, correct. It's the one I was going down around. Well, no, you were you were one over. I was not. There's three shoots. One, two, three. Well, shoot. Maybe this shoot ain't so bad. We're in the wrong shoot. <laughs> Clearly, from a size perspective. I mean, it is the wrong shooter for catching fish like that. Just saying. Travis is angry this morning, everybody at home. I don't know why. Is he hungry? I, I'm not sure, but we'll let this little guy go. I also do a video. Happens. Brian, Brian the Carpenter from the Ike Live Show. Dude's awesome, man. Had a blast. Hopefully, hopefully he wants to fish another tournament with me. We had a few laughs that day. Travis, you all right? You got one? On camera. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> I had no idea how big it was. <laughs> uh, how's your head? Yeah, we're good. <laughs> Pretty good bag in the boat. Fairly early. Good three, three and a half pound average. And a little later on, around midday, I ended up hooking up with this beast in the marina, just a random marina that they can get in it sometimes, but this is the only one I got out of here. But it was an epic battle. Check this out, guys. I actually thought I lost the fish in the net. I thought I saw the bait. I did see the bait, but I thought the hook was out of the fish's mouth, so I set the rod down. You'll see, it's crazy. Definitely got a few other local tournaments. This is the ABA event. It's also videotaped some team events. Unreal. Throughout the year as well. Oh my God. I also get to spend some time back home in Wisconsin where I grew up and uh, hang out with my buddies. Some of them are pretty rough around the edges. In case you guys don't know that, that's a cheap beer here in Wisconsin. <laughs> when you live in a trailer park, that's pretty much how you roll. Yeah, well, when you've got two kids and daycare costs you $1,200 a month, but you're also an alcoholic and like to fish, sacrifices have to be made. <laughs> That 
that's a way of looking at it. Well, what? I got beer, dude, but if you're too prude and don't like it, go yourself. <laughs> uh, I gotta show you guys Steve's truck. Of course, there's beer in here. <laughs> Empty beer bottles. Oh my god, look at this. Some Copenhagen. Oh. <laughs> Why you have a locator in here? Don't worry about I gotta it. I got to look at that. I gotta show so you know how that. some people have ice fishing shanties? Wow. Steve just has holes in his yes. floorboards. Is this a tire now? And he fishes right out of this truck as well. What are you wearing now, bro? Unreal. Straight under armor. <laughs> so Steve's little trailer here. Oh, man. I don't know why he's got a Lawrence in here. Let's see his uh, choice in music. We got the Oak Ridge Boys, Willie Nelson, Johnny Cash. Oh, some more chew down there. Oh my gosh. The turkey feathers. Oh man. You're living life large, Steve. The original patch pirate. You are. Is it the other way around? You both. Might be me. Might be me. All right. So this is my. This is a nice. This is a nice boat. I'm excited. We got jet skiers coming out with us. Everybody's here tonight. Man. All right, Kyle. How are we gonna do tonight? You think? Decent. Probably gonna win. <laughs> Probably gonna win. Man. So not a lot of video, you know, guys. Just cause they're kind of, you know, we're making a long run. Go. Hydrated. Oh God. Well, we got a special one here. Bam! All right, three, 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 three alive. Don't worry about it. I'll get them. Actually, the, the the launch was happening tonight. Freaking happened. So we won the tournament, guys. I think you already knew that. I'm just letting you know we won the tournament because I love winning tournaments. The old Nitro performed. Kyle came through. I came through. I came through a little bit as well. And uh, I think we made like four grand tonight. That was pretty good for a Thursday night. Yeah, right? BFO money. Ah, dang. What's up? Got a little fishing with my dad. Let's go fishing. Okay. You gonna talk or you gonna fish? Have you been here before? Uh, two years ago, you know? It's been a while. Yeah, we caught a couple. I had that six pounder that morning right away. Yeah, good day for it. I'm ready. I can take your picture with it. What else can you do? That's about it. Once in a while I know how to get voicemail, but it's hard. You gotta give them a code or something. Right. It works. I'll take your picture. That's alright. I just don't know how to work it. No. We're good. Got one? Small at all. Probably five. Oh, yeah. How are you doing, Travis? There he is, there he is. We're gonna talk about Paul in a little bit. Let's get out there, let's start idling out, and I'll tell you the whole story on Paul. Could see him cruising around there. I don't know if you can pick any of them up on the video or not. 
They're all the same. Beautiful, that's a pig. Oh my God, that's a pig. <laughs> well, we put the hammer down on some offshore pre-spawn smallies. Man, back in Wisconsin, it's so much fun, especially this time of year. So many fish. Got a bunch of videos on my YouTube channel. That's a monster. Covering all the days and all the fish catches. We got a special guest with us. Yo G! Yo, yo, yo! There he is. Yoji, what's up, man? That's Yoji with an R. <laughs> for all you guys. Yoji and I go way, way back, and Yoji knows how to catch a fish or two every once in a while. Every once in a while, I make that one count. Yes. That's all that matters, that one. The fish. one fish, the one fish. I think we're gonna get on today. What do you yep. think? Bam! 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 He says. Shots fired. That's right. Shots fired. It's all good. That's a nice fish. Oh yeah. Yoji Under got one. Under the trawler. What are you doing up front, anyways? While I'm retying. I don't know, man. Opportunities, yo. <laughs> Opportunities for What'd you catch? Oh, you caught another one on that? On this guy, yeah. Dude, that's your second big one. That's my big one. Nice. Woo, baby, look at this. Nice. The Ica. The Ica. Man, I haven't used an Ica in years. That's like your. I'm a to go bait. I have to go bait. I use this guy for almost 12 years now. Really? Never done me wrong. The fat Ica. Jeez. You can bounce off the bottom, swim off the bottom like a tube. Yeah. You can swim on the, on the top of the water. Well, you've been laying on your back for a little bit. It's kind of awkward, isn't it? Yeah. <laughs> it actually feels nice, though. <laughs> All right, we're going to release her. Okay, perfect. Nice fish, dude. Thanks, bud. Let her go. Just like that. Well, the Gajo spirit, Shad. Does the magic again. Is working. This is a good fish. Oh yeah, she's a spot. I mean, how big is he? Five? Two. All right guys, a little update. All the fish are actually suspended out here. Doesn't matter if you're in four feet of water or 15. They're six inches below the surface and there's thousands of them. Yoji, I think is figuring it out. How crazy is that? Look at this stud. Yeah, that's a stud. Wow. Whoa. Well, that ain't no small fish. <laughs> that's it. That's a stud. <laughs> Jeez. And we end the month of May back home on the Chesapeake Bay. And the fish are cooperating. Color, uh, perch pattern, whatever, whatever you want to call it. But it's a great color in the grass this time of year. There you go, brother. That guy choked her. Look at that. In the mouth. I saw that wake coming. That's a good fish there. Solid, solid grass fish. All right, I hope you guys enjoyed the videos that we put together. Part two is going to come up in a few days, so look forward to that. Please subscribe if you haven't already. Leave any comments below. And as always, until next time, we'll see you guys on the water.